Now, for those of us that had the chance to play Pac-Man after it was first released, let's just say it was a little underwhelming. And it did not hold up to the original at all. As a matter of fact, it is the game that singularly made Christmas as horrible as it was for me that one year in 1982. I specifically asked for this game. I specifically got this game. And then I played and I had lost all hope in humanity on that day. Now, Atari was so confident in this port that they actually had a million copies made right at launch. They anticipated that it was going to be a system seller, but they did not realize what the final product would look like. And this is what it looks like. Imagine the horror of an eight-year-old child who had lived his life around video games at that time to see this little character called Pac-Man looking as horrible as he did, not making the waka waka noise, but actually sounding like a banjo strumming one string over and over again. <laughs> 